Hello, welcome to lesson 12, Structure in C-Sharp, brought to you by Ankara Technologies. My name is Harish. In this session, we are going to learn what is structure. In C-Sharp, structure is a value type, data type. It means, uh, it means that structure is a data type first and it comes under the category value type. Okay, and what is the use of, what is the use of using a structure? It means that it helps you to make a single variable old related data of various data types. It means that in a single variable you can hold multiple data types, values of multiple data types. That is the main advantage of structure. It means that it helps you to make a single variable old related data of various data types. You are having a variable and you are making that variable to hold values of various data types whether it can be an int, string, float, double etc. That is a major advantage of structure. The struct keyword, how do you create a structure? The struct keyword is used for creating a structure. We have to use struct followed by the structure name uh, to create a structure and structures are used to represent a rec record. This is the major advantage of structure. Suppose if you want to represent a record, whether it can be a library record or student record or employee record, then you can go for the structures. Suppose for example, if you want to create or if you want to keep a track of your books in the library, you might want that, what are the major things you want to identify a book? It thinks uh, you need title of the title of the book, author of the book, subject and the book ID. This this and all, these four things, that is title, author, subject and book ID can be attached to a single variable. Okay. And now, this is a sample program. To define the structure, what we do is, we, we use the struct keyword and the struct statement defines a new data type and the struct statement, the statement it defines a data type. Struct is a data type first with more than one member for your program. Means what? Using the structure, you can have the values of various data types. You can observe here, structure is a data type and it holds the data types of string and integer. That is the advantage of structure. It's a, structure is a data type and it allows when it is used as data type for a variable and that variable can hold data types of values of any data types. Okay, that is the major advantage of structure. You can observe here, we have title, author, subject and book ID and the first three are string type and the last one is integer. It means that here it's a mixture of string string data type and integer data type and where it is defined? It is defined in a structure. That is the capacity of a structure. For example, here is a way you can declare the book structure. You are observing here, this is the struct books. It's a book record where it contains title, author, subject and book ID. Now we'll see in Visual Studio how, do, how, can, how can you make use of a structure. I'm having a project, I'm creating a new project. Visual Studio is opening a template project for us. And my language is Visual Studio Sharp. I'll take the console application. Now, I'll give the project name as struct struct demo. Now, once I'm done with this, okay, it's creating a console template for us. Let's wait for that. And the project name is I've given struct demo. Using struct, you can make a record. Means you can keep a record of a book or an employee or a student. Now, how do you define the struct? To define the struct, you have a keyword called struct followed by the name. I'll take the example of I'll take this example which is present in the slide struct books. Struct books. Then I'll just what are the properties? Title, author, subject, and book ID. Okay. Title. Sorry. title I'll start it with a small letter since it is a title I'll copy the same thing for other two things control V control V control V I'll check the author subject and book ID author
subject and the final one is book id and since book id is a number i have to change data type also it is integer once i am having this structure uh, struct keyword means struct structure once i am having this structure you can observe once i am having this struct books I'm having four fields that is title, author, subject, and book ID. And the struct books is like a skeleton. Now, using the struct books, we can create a multiple titles, and multiple authors, multiple subject, and multiple book IDs. How do we do that? It's very simple. You just create object of it of that struct. How do we create books? And I'll take it as B1. Finish now b1 will be having b1 will be having all the properties which is present in the struct books how how to access them now using b1 i can access using b1 i can access title author and the subject because i have created an object of it once i have done that i have created a i created a variable for books one using b1 we can access all the properties that is title author subject and book id how do i do that b1 dot I'm getting a title I'm telling book title is C sharp five point O done similarly I'm having B one dot author Herbert G R B E R T Herbert Sklerit and next is subject it's programming dot book id and read once i'm having this books b1 now using b1 we having title using b1 we can access all the properties which are present in this structure books book structure is something like a skeleton and using that skeleton we can build number of books now if i want another book to book B two. Now, how do I do that? Similarly, I'll create an object. I'll I'll create a variable called B two. Sorry. Now, once I'm having this B two, it's same as like you can access the properties. But the thing is. JavaScript Brendan Brendan Neck Programming Book ID is 500 Now you can observe here as I said you previously structure is something like a skeleton using that skeleton we can add multiple books means it is something like you are having a struct and using that struct you are creating multiple objects of it multiple using that creating a object of books the destruct b1 you can access you can you can build number of books now i'm having two books my object is to print them how do i do that b1 title
just copying and pasting the same code but I want to change here b1 author b3 author This is book ID. I'm copying this and I'm pasting here. Okay. What I'll do is I'll just copy Control C and I'll replace Control V. Now I have to change the numbers. The thing is, I'm just copying and pasting instead of typing everything. Now I have to print another one statement telling that. details of book one so we have to copy this details of book two now once I'm done with this I'll run my program by pressing ctrl F5 you can observe details of book one that is C sharp 5 title and author is Albert Skilled and the language is programming and ID is 100. Similarly, details of JavaScript author Bindernack programming and find it. The thing is, you should observe I'm creating only the record once, means that uh, struct I'm creating only once, but I'm making use of that struct in, ma in my main program in so many ways. Means I can create multiple books of different title, different author, and different subject using a struct that is a major advantage of using a struct 